Hi Aquarius, getting ready to do your reading. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. <clears throat> All right. All right, so some of you are starting with the Three of Coins, Page of Coins, Ten of Wands, whoops, the Seven of Coins in the World. A lot of coins going on here. All right. Definitely might be a new job or relationship. You could be getting an offer because people appreciate how well you do your work. Or it could be someone who admires you and you're in, in like a love sense. So there's something new starting with the world though, new cycle. And maybe you don't even realize it yet. It doesn't have to big, be a big deal. Sometimes new cycles start unexpectedly. So, but you are burdened here. So it may be a job, a relationship that you put a lot of effort in but you're just not happy or it's just too stressful. And you may get something new, a new offer. So let's go back around. Yeah, you've been looking at this for a while. So this definitely might be a partnership or a love life. Yeah, because this is making you feel out in the cold. So maybe you're thinking, oh, there you are, nice. So this is something that where you're going to put yourself first. That's what that's telling me right away. You do have the two of wands under there. So you are thinking about something new. So this is something that you've been looking at for a while now. I don't know if you've been feeling blocked or if you have just decided to take time to look at the situation because it is something Aquarius you've been doing a great job at. You put in the effort, gave it 110%, um, tried to get along, tried to work together, but it's left you. Now either you did this to get out of feeling left out in the cold and feeling burdened. So this could be working really hard at a new job or business and creating more finances. And so now you are starting a new phase or this could be a relationship where you thought, you know what, I'm going to work on it. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to put my all into it. But some of you may decide to be single. You're feeling that this partnership or this relationship isn't really worth it. And you're getting very little back. Sometimes the page of coin can look like getting just a small little portion back. Okay. But the sun is coming. Okay. So this does appear to be love. I was going to read it as money for some of you career, but, um, this is a person showing up. So now you have new love coming in. So what I'm seeing here is that you are tired of putting the effort into this and you get an offer, but you're like, you know what? This isn't good enough. I'd rather be single and you're getting something new in. So even though the six of coins, I'm gonna have to clarify that. Even though the six of coins technically is, you know, can be a very one-sided card. It could be that someone is putting in effort, someone else besides you, because now we have a King of Cups showing up with the sun. Um, let's see, what is the Five of Wands? Though? Why are you conflicted about this? Okay, so you're not sure if you should move away. What is the sun? I'm getting a couple different things. Yeah. All right, so that's what I'm getting. That's what the Six of Coin is. All right, it is one side, and that's why you're conflicted. For a lot of you, this is a relationship, but it could work, be, you know, work situation, even friendship, but it's a relationship where you put a lot of effort into it and nobody else did. The other person didn't. So you realize, you know what, I can move on and find new love. I don't know if this new love is here or if this is what you're thinking about because it's going to come in. You decided that this wasn't worth it anymore. And I feel like as soon as somebody realizes you're going to leave the relationship and move on, and again, it could be a work partnership, but they decide to come in as the King of Cups. It could be a fake King of Cups. You know, they could be just afraid now that you're going to leave them. They better step up. They may realize now that they're not putting the effort in. So now they're going to the Six of Coins. But again, now the Six of Coins to me could be, you know, very one-sided. They're not putting in a lot of effort, you know. Sometimes, you know, other readers, uh, you know, read that as he's giving them like just breadcrumbs, just a little bit, just, you know, so I just feel like you're not satisfied with this person is giving you, even though they know now you're going and they're going to regret losing you. They may have not never thought you would actually move on. So they're going to put in a little effort and this may be where you're conflicted because I feel like you get a good idea of the sun. You may meet someone new. You may get this idea about being single and dating again. So you're happy. This other person sees that you're happy. You're moving on. So now they don't, they want to hang on to you and put in a little bit of effort, but it's not a whole lot. This is where the conflict I think comes in your mind. Now this could be actually fighting with this person. Um, this could be you thinking, 
I don't think you're really thinking. I think you already thought enough. I think you already saw the writing on the wall with the hangman. You already knew it was going on. You were in this, you were in this alone. So you're, there may be some, a little bit of fighting, some words exchanged, but you've already moved on. You're not, you're not willing to put more time into this. Now, this could also be that the King of Cups is someone new coming in. Definitely. A new lover, because obviously we have the Ace of Cups. So the other person is going to regret you leaving them. They're going to realize that they probably didn't, well, they may not realize, but they're going to look at five. They may just feel sorry for themselves, Five of Cups, actually. They may not regret anything and even think it's their fault. They may, that may be way of the Five of Wands. You may try to point out to them, they really didn't participate in this, so you're moving on to something better. So I see them being more feeling sorry for themselves with the King of Cups energy. Any sign doesn't matter. They're just having a pity party. And instead of taking ownership of them not really doing anything and how you put a lot of effort in. I'm going to do one more with the Six of Swords to see where you're going. Yeah, definitely may have this person following you. If it's just, you know, texting you, getting mad at you, something. You may move quickly, though. Let's see. Nine of Swords, please. To a new beginning. Okay, so I could read that e either way. Someone might be upset with you, but it's just more like negative words, texting. Otherwise, you're moving forward to something new with Ace of Swords quickly. And of course, Nine of Swords could just be your energy. So um, if this is a job, I do have the Eight of Coins under there right now. If this is a job or a partnership, you will find something better. I feel some of you will be quitting a company and working alone, working for yourself. Someone, again, will kind of will miss you if you do that, if you are, you know, going off on your own. <clears throat> you may start at a somewhat smaller pay also, but still, <clears throat> pardon me. I'm still seeing the six of coins being bigger than the page of coins, even though that may not be true technically. It's like you work for this company and you made really good money. So you may take a small drop back to six instead of seven, but that's okay. They're, they're paying you direct now. So instead of going through your employer who is taking a lot of your money um, in this partnership, because you may be working with this person. This person may have been a partner in a company. Um, you're going to go solo is what I'm seeing here. They're not going to like it, but you're going to be very successful. And they will play the pity party card is what I'm seeing. Some, some of the clients may follow you. So they're going to pay you direct. And I think they're going to be more appreciative of your work at, with the Six of Coins. You know what I mean? They know. I think you carried the company. You were the one doing all the work, but uh, someone else was taking a lot of the credit, even though it was you who had the skills and the quality. So... I see a new beginning with the world card for you, Aquarius. Things are going to go very well. Very well. So I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a great week and take care.